Hi everyone. Um, I was just collecting sticks, as you can see. I live in the forest and it's um, winter now here in um, southern Australia where I live. And I just thought, oh, here's a tidbit of goddess wisdom I can share with you. Um, there is a very good reason that um, we don't use uh, the slur word faggot. And a lot of people use that term without actually understanding where it comes from. And I think if people understand where it comes from, they're less likely to use it. Um, basically, faggots were the sticks used to um, burn people at the stake. And of course, there were the witch burnings throughout old Europe where up to 9 million women, it's claimed, were burnt at the stake. And their number one crime was either being a midwife, which means with woman, helping women to birth, or a herbalist. In other words, they um, were a threat to the growing medical establishment because they were treating the peasant class for uh, less cost um, using ancient herbal remedies. So anybody that expressed the gifts of the feminine or their feminine nature was persecuted. And this extended to men who expressed the feminine in them, uh, their nature, which was, of course, a lot of gay men. And so this is why the term then got used as a put-down for a gay man. And it's very important that we stop and acknowledge that it's futile to fight patriarchy, which is the uh, culture that we've grown up in which is afraid of the feminine because it doesn't understand the feminine. Um, patriarchy is an illness. It needs to be healed within the collective psyche, which means within each of us. So it's about understanding the origins, going back and um, reclaiming ancient feminine wisdom. And those insights heal the illusions and the false truths that we've been taught, which bigotry and persecution thrive in. So that's today's goddess wisdom tip. Uh, I'm Tanishka. Thank you for watching.